we're back at it. Part 12. Bloodborne. Let's do it. All right. We beat the hell out of the... Uh, I don't know what the hell was her name. Murgo? Margo? I don't know. We beat the hell out of her wet nurse. Took her to Pound Town. Uh, that took the whole stream last stream. That was the entire episode. And now we get to just uh, explore the castle of Mensis' Nightmare. And then we're going to go to Kanehurst Castle. That's going to be the episode tonight. Let's do it. Literally just got on my PC, says Desi, over in the chat. Okay, so I should also mention, that's a live stream right there. This message, this part of the video, which, by the way, got cut off last night. YouTube cut it off. Uh, this is just for the vodsters. Anyone watching in the archive on the YouTube channel? Ah, love every one of you guys. All right. I love the livesters, too, but I can't kiss them live. It wouldn't be the same. All right. God damn it, everybody. We're going to get going. Uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Uh, thanks for... Uh, Everyone who followed uh, last episode on the YouTube channel, or on the uh, Twitch channel. We got some new viewers. Ah, oh, it's lovely to see. We're growing the crowd. Uh, guys, if you ever want to uh, be a part of the offline content, that's the Discord. Scoot! Get scooting! Alrighty. Uh, Vale and I are quick on the draw. You guys you got out of your mind. You guys are quick. Vale was quicker than I was tonight. I wasn't even set up yet. He was already in the chat. Alright. Get your Diet Pepsi Caffeine Freeze ready. Because we're about to get out of our minds. I dropped a Dan while no one was here. Is that the new colloquialism for just dumping your guts out? I dropped a Dan. It was a wet one. Good lord. All right. We're going to get the livesters in here now. I'm going to do my social media content. Oh, man. But this is a message just for the uh, viewers in the archive and apparently the two livesters who never leave. You could be like those guys, all you vodsters. You could be like these two rascals right here. The choice is yours. Standing by for some action, some hot action. I hear there's hot action going on. Closing in on 600k points. Wow, you are always on the right side of history here. Oh, poor, poor uh, Desi. Or not Desi, uh, uh, Devin. Just gets rocked by these things every time. Yeah, you won the prediction. We beat it. All right, sorry, brought the full sugar cherry Pepsi. Fully caffeinated. You're going to get out of your mind because you get the, the sugar and the goddamn caffeine. All right, Vale's going to be chatting his balls off tonight. Confirm. Dan, get the hell out of my club! You guys ever notice him in the background? On the TV screen there? And the details. I beat the wet nurse. Yeah, well, we had, um, what was it? Easterly one came in and just gave me the pro tip saying, like, why don't you just try and hit her in the back? What the hell did you just say to me? And that was the ticket. Turns out I could dodge some of the attacks. Some of these bosses, you can't dodge their attacks. This was one of the ones where it's like, all right, you can dodge them. All right. You just get you get rocked. There's so many bets I can't afford. I can't afford to take that chance, everybody. Not while the bets are on. All right, there we go. Discord knows about it now. Not just the two crazy livesters. All right, advantage iframes. Yeah, I was actually dodging everything. That was an easy boss to dodge. I don't think it was skill. I just think it was an easy boss to dodge. And the hell with it. It was all skill. All right, now Twitter knows about it, but I do need to tell them the right places to go because I... I now tell them to go to the replies for the links. Apparently, Elon Musk will downvote your Twitter post if it has a link in it. Won't go to all the people it should. This hasn't been helping me at all either, but whatever. It's what smart managers do to win ball games. All right, everybody. All right, now the uh, Facebookers know. Mostly my mom. Hi, mom. I don't think she'd watch this game. It's too vile. It's too vile. Damn you, Elon. Actually, thank you, Elon, for divulging the uh, algorithm. All right, we got Rad Jams here from Shakedown Hawaii. Guys, get the hell onto that uh, Bandcamp. Stream some audio. If you feel like it, go ahead and purchase it. Or just stream it. Spread the word, though. I'd love to make some more synth stuff. Oh, God. Well, there we go. What? God damn it, I need to change my stream labs, because that is not actually even... <laughs> that's not the Bandcamp. There, I'll go real quick. I'll show you where to go. Radland. Studios.bandcamp.com. HTTP. Eh. No, we'll go HTTPS. We want everyone to be safe here. That's what the S stands for. Safe. There we go. Boom. Oh, that was Desi. Okay, I thought it was. Just, I know sometimes it randomly does it. I need to fix it, Desi. 
I'll do that when the show starts. Do you guys think I should give everyone on Discord uh, a heads up on my other channels? Should I do that? Should I be a rascal? I mean, they know I'm going live. You know, they should know. At Bell's house, or Fred's house. I went into Jimmy Stewart there. Ah, to hell with it. Minute and 47, whatever. We'll just let the core crew know about tonight. If you know, you know. And maybe I'll take this minute and 40 seconds to just get out of my mind and fix that damn Streamlabs. Hot content. Streamlabs.com Quit hosing it up, Streamlabs. Actually, this is my hosing. Uh, who wants to drink from the fire hose? That little kid's head would have got blown off. Name that movie. Oh, just enjoying some water here. Go to the dashboard, please. Not the alert box. The widgets. Uh, the commands. That's what we need. The hell of the commands. Cloudbot. Hell yeah. Don't ever change your name or your website name. It's too much hassle. The name you pick when you're 14 years old should stick with you for the rest of your life. That is a fact. All right. Here we go. Radlandstudios.bandcamp.com. Let me actually check if that is the right one. I want to send everyone the wrong place. There you go. Shake down Hawaii. Check it out. Live it. Love it. Dream it. Let's go. Confirm it. Perfect timing. 27 seconds to get over minds. Okay. And let me just check. Let me just double check. Band camp. Hey, we locked it up. All right. We're going to beat the hell out of the... Well, you know what? Actually, we beat the boss. Now we just get to explore. We get to explore Mensis' nightmare. I don't know why he's still having this nightmare. Why? What the hell is... Who the hell is Mensis? I don't even know. I don't know, and you know what? I don't care. If I see him, he's a dead man. <laughs> Where all the goddamn action is. Welcome back, everybody. All right. Fred, you can get back up here. Yeah! God, I'm having so much fun with Bloodborne. It's out of control. I'm curious to learn about your second super secret project. I just don't know... I don't know if I'm allowed to n say the name of the game. I should really ask developers whenever I start a project. Can I mention your game on social media? That's right, the second project's Tom and Jerry Kids. Where all the action is... I will have to sing. I was practicing some vocals in the car today. I need a character to do. I was like, alright, what, what character should I do? I might as well just base it on that one. They sent me some uh, anime. I can get you! You know, like that, so I'm gonna have to... I don't know how to translate that into English, because it doesn't work. If you sing anime lyrics, like over-the-top dramatic anime lyrics in English... And then he took a gun! And he shot the bad guy in the face! It doesn't work. It doesn't work. Me, 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 my, my, me, moo, moo, moo. Alright, everyone. And by everyone, I mean Veiled and Desi. Let's get out of our minds. Let's play this goddamn game. And let's pray for a stream free of getting fricked. All right, maybe Shorty could do some finished death metal vocals. With with so many accents over the vowels. I need I need three A's in a row, and each A has a different accent. Or ulop or whatever they're called. Uh, he's got the right deep voice for it. Yame. That he does. All right, you were a choir, weren't you? Now that I think of it, no, that was uh, Dingle Dude. He was the singer. I was into art and drama, and then I got the hell out of that school because they were rascal me. They they didn't like my art very much. I would, oh my god! Oh, why don't I turn the music on for one more second? Uh, vale and I went to the same high school. It was an art school. I went there from grade three till ten, and then did eleven and twelve in public school, um, which I think was just the right amount. Anyways, I specialized in art, drawing, and I only ever used a ballpoint pen whenever they gave me a choice. I mean, I would do... Uh, we, today we're doing pastel. All right, fine. I can't wait to use that ballpoint pen, though. Hmm? Uh, but yeah, whenever we would have to do stuff where it's like, all right, sit across the table from someone and draw them on a piece of paper. That was like one of the activities. So I would draw the person and then not draw the... They said, you don't have to draw the top of the head. Just work on the face. I'm like, all right, so finish early and then draw the inside of the top of the head with a brain coming out. I did extra stuff, and they're like, I don't know what to do with you, buddy. Like, I'm giving you extra content. You guys hate me for it. All right, Dingle was, but I thought you were in a regular choir. Dingle was singing as Mad Men. Yeah, he, was, he took it seriously. He went hard and heavy on the singing. Old Rad never sang a, a song in his life. The only song I can sing you from start to finish is Break the Ice by John Farnham. Get ready to break the ice. 
I should go on uh, American Idol and just crush that one. All right, he could uh, skibbity beat. Yeah, he was fully vocal jazz. You could kind of hear some of that vocal jazz influence in uh, Dingle Dude's band. Just a hint. All of them were in vocal jazz or jazz of some kind. All right. The band was called $10 Thompson and then changed to Snake Handshakes. Check it out, everyone, if you're out of your mind. Okay, time to play some games. Time to get over our minds. Time to have our minds blown. Uh, Modern. Boom. Done. Let's go. This old man is out of his mind. Get the blood moving. Uh, yeah, you sing vocal jazz, it gets the blood going. And the blood boiling. Yeah. Alright, so where we left off, we beat the hell out of the wet nurse. Desi <laughs> walks away with another 100,000 points. I actually got a message in my uh, email box to participate in some charity with like an actual charity event organizer. I am wondering if they thought people were donating real money. Because it was like 100,000k! Because they sent me a message. They must have been watching, but like, do you guys know that I don't have a lot of people watching the show at any given time? The charity's gonna suffer. They're like, it's all banking on red. I'll have to get back to them and be like, all right, sounds sounds all right. Let do tell more. This guy's betting the farm. There's so much money flying around this place. Hey, I don't know the story, the backstory in the game. Why are there all these guys with these cages on their face? It's because they were trying to bite the correction officers. What? I was also not the singer. Younger Nomad uh, was and still is the singer. I didn't know he was the singer. I didn't know he did anything. I don't actually know what... I guess he was in music, wasn't he? What was your major? Were you into band? Uh, flip shot and I carry a tune. Alright. You guys got to get the family band going. <laughs> family bands are funny. Ah, uh, like Hanson. Are you out of your mind at drums? You're like, hey, get that Dillinger Escape Plan song over here. I'll knock it out of the park. Oh, my fanny! Marilyn Monroe's dress, am I right? Okay, now where the hell am I going? Welcome in, Hatter. Borrowed some rad bucks from Grandma Hatter. <laughs> I'm here to bet. Okay, we'll have to find something else to bet on because we beat the hell out of the boss last time we were here. And now... Devin over on YouTube, get over there, buddy. I just heard something fall down. My cat better not be trying to climb on the goddamn uh, fireplace again. That is cause for dismissal. Alright. Or Canada's answer to Hanson, the Moffats. Oh, God, yeah. Uh, she thinks I'm using them for school books or something. Pfft. It's a cold, hard bet. Alright, God damn it. Where is the bridge? I gotta go back to where that first boss was. Down here. Now I can cross the bridge. Now that I won't get pelted with goddamn spears of frenzy. Like ranch flavored soda. Now you guys are speaking. Those are golden ticket ideas right there. Million dollar ideas. Is that a real. Was that actually a real thing? There you go. And for that, Desi gives you a big shout out. Guys, do check out Hatter. It's a vibe. It's a great time. Hatter, what are you playing these days? You're playing Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker on a, on a PSP? How's, how the hell are you doing that? We do need more Hatter in our lives. God damn it. I, all I hear is things falling down upstairs. And I'm just looking at the monitor. Baby Boy Rat is still asleep in his bed. Come on, go for it. Take the first swing. No! No, he just put his goddamn whip away. I thought he was going to give him the poke attack. All right. All right, well, this guy's earned himself a one-way ticket to Cheese Dink Town. Oh, no, he came running around the corner. All right, get the hell out of here. This little a-hole is beating me senseless. All right, they're going to pound him. In the HD collection. Oh, okay, that's a good way to go. Better than hooking up your PSP. Tino, get in here, buddy. Tino's always watching, and he's always wearing tiny, tiny jorts. He only kind. Is there any other kind? John Cena thought he knew how jorts work. No. Tino is the last man standing in jorts and jort technology. Hey, with jort technology, we're going back to the moon. That's a fact. You think this old man could be running sick maneuvers like this if he wasn't secretly wearing a pair of tiny jorts underneath that uh, blood-covered trench coat? All right, I'm looking forward to not getting pelted by uh, 
frenzy spears anymore, everyone. Oh my god. Ah, it feels good. Now we can finally play the game like the JRPG it is. I'm saying, uh, what's better than streaming for uh, from the PSP? Absolutely nothing. Jack Frick, that's what. Man, all these sound effects sound like a little uh, scampering lizard, but I can't can't pinpoint it. All right, JRPG logic determined that nothing was back here. The lie detector test determined that was a lie. Got to go be a parent for. All right, go do your dad mode, buddy. Always nice to see Hatter either way. Whether he's a dad or not, it's always nice to see. All right, this whole place needs to get cleaned up. There's just cages with skeletons everywhere. People hanging. To, yeah, what the hell is going on? There's bones literally everywhere under my feet. This bridge, yeah, uh, Desi, you didn't see it last night. I was still getting peppered with freaking spears of frenzy from this vantage point. I think the guy was actually literally right, ab right above me. There was no way out of here, uh, so we had to go find a secret way to get him. One of the new members, uh, Easterly One, uh, gave me some pro tips. Said, ah, don't fight him here. It's just going to be a hassle for you. Go in the secret way around. Jump off an elevator while you're scooting through. I'm like, ah, oh, the one elevator that had the door that didn't close? Ah, I should have been able to find that. I should have been able to find it, but I didn't. Well, get ready for nightmares, everyone, because there's nothing but spiders with human faces in here, so... And enemies with eyeballs that can bite my head off, literally. Sorry to do that to you. I only have two healing items. I probably shouldn't have gone in this. Oh, God, no! I forgot that I still get frenzied by those eyeball guys. Hold on. All right, go down. I'm going to have to cross the bridge, beat the hell out of that guy, get out of my mind. Oh, yeah, Easterly did play this game a lot. But you know what? Some of the fans of this game, they're in, like, what was the guy that was in here the other day? He's like, unfortunately, I know this place better than I know my own house. Get patches. Oh, right. There should be a patches spider, right? Is he a salesman in this game? Well, here's the game plan. I'm just running in there and beating the hell out of that stupid eyeball guy that gives me frenzy. I hate frenzy. That seems like there's a spot I can't walk over there. I should probably go back up and around and get the drop on him, right? That guy. Ugh. He still got my blood echoes, too. Uh, can I cross this thing and go fight him? God. Uh. Here we go. And where's the dead man? He's over here. Frick him. Yeah, now you don't like that so much, do you? No, you ain't gonna hug me. I get hugged only by those that I choose worthy of my hugs. Uh-oh, almost bit the dust there. And I'm still biting the dust. And I'm gonna bite the dust if I don't kill him right now! Oh, god damn it. Ah, frick. Goddamn frenzy. I, I hit the... I popped the blood vial when I meant to pop the goddamn uh, sedative. I know, Vale, I know. It's because one is on triangle and one is on square. Eh. At least they're not so hard. I just got to go hard and heavy on them and not get hugged. Drop Mother Brain into the depths. Yeah, we have to go deal with Mother Brain still, right? I guess, I guess that's true. Now I have zero goddamn vials. This game really hosed that up. No one wants to go search for blood vials, all right? Well, it's no big deal. Just go to Witch's Cove, fight the guys a couple times, and you get your blood vials back. I don't want to do that. I want to play the game. The game that you presented me with, I would like to play it. You had the right model with the Estes Flask. Just give me 20 every time I light my house on fire. I don't think that's asking too much. No. Devin, I don't know how I missed every NPC in this game. I found the one lady and then immediately did a blood transfusion with her. This game would be much easier with JRPG pausing uh, and using potion size. No, they want that. They want that tension there. <laughs> you square to use the items and triangle to heal yourself. <sighs> All right, let's go get some damn blood vials for cheap. 
I'm on the cheap here, everybody. I'm not using my do. I'm not doing the do. No. I took that guy down, though. I could have easily killed him. It's like, I easily killed you, you a-hole. And you. Okay, all right. You don't have to poke me. You don't have to brand me. Stop scaring Smithers. Didn't go so well. That, oh, Jesus. Hey, you hurting those girls, dude. You hurt those girls, man. Don't tell me how to run my life. He's going for a headbutt there with no head. Those guys are supposed to be headless. All right, heal. My sick gains. Take a hit there. That's fine. You got to spend money to make money. And that is what they say. I don't know how to get down into the depths, though, Devin. You're dead, Becky. Okay, okay. Easy there, fella. Don't you dare give me any... Whoa, god dang. All right, that does no, no damage at all. Look how strong I am now. God, it feels good. See, Vale, that's what I'm saying. You got to play these games where you get to feel strong as frick. This game lets you feel strong as frick. Skyrim doesn't let you do that. Skyrim. Skyrim's like, all right, the whole world levels up with you, even this lady asleep in her house. You're a level 20 with maximum everything. She still takes more than one hit to kill. In fact, she can probably take you out. Neither do I. The game would be, huh? Neither do I, but I'm sure you'll make your way. Okay. I can't. Uh, we're flat broke. We got no. What? There's dead bodies everywhere. Like the corn song says. Jesus Christ. All right, we're good for nine bl uh, vials every time we go. And then I can take some of these hot uh, gains I have, money, and go buy some blood vials. It won't take long. It won't take long, everybody. Or they could have just given me all that I needed um, with the Estus, Estus Flask technique. No. So Vale, and uh, this game would be much easier. Okay, sorry. Uh, or you can pause and check out uh, Castle Kane. Yeah, we're going there after. I'm not going to take out the, the eyeball here because I think I should have taken out Castle Kanehurst or Kanehurst Castle sooner than this. I think I'm going to be super overpowered when I roll in there. That's just what I'm guessing, Devin. Over on YouTube. If anyone's wondering who the hell said that, Devin over on YouTube. I might as well just do this. Devin's going to be chatting. I might as well go like this. Uh, I forgot it doesn't show Devin's chat, so we might as well go bing bong. There's Devin. He's been on YouTube the whole time chatting his balls off. And I've been talking to him. You guys said, Brad's losing it. He's talking to himself again. Hey, Rad, are you on YouTube? Can people go to YouTube and hit that like button? You goddamn can, everyone. You scoot on over to YouTube. You have a great time. I don't know if anyone's watching. It's probably, as far as I know, it's just you guys watching. So why, why would I spam you guys? There's a YouTube channel. Live it. Laugh it. Love it. Um... We're streaming them both, but that is where all the edited content also goes. So we get hot streams over there, but we also get edited content. Oh, two for one. Two for... Two for Sutherland. All right, little terrorist with her Molotov cocktail. Go to hell, Becky. All right, he didn't much like the Becky comment. Well, I'm going to get him one of these days. Hold him. Dead Becky. And confirm, Rad is losing it. No, I'm not losing it now. That's the confirmation. All right, so I can only hold 20 blood vials in the box as well. They should have just let you stockpile as many as you want. Right, I'm sick of Becky giving me the business. Jesus Christ. This cane is so powerful. All right, never mind. I just took an axe in the face. All right, I'm risking it, dude. What the goddamn hell he went for? It? Did you guys see the range on that thing? Well, strong as I am, big as you is, that guy still managed to take me to Poundtown. That is horse crap. That's fine. That's fine. All right, remember when these guys were freaking you left, right? And now they're a uh, three-hit kill, but they can still frick me up. That's fine. We'll go get our blood echoes. I will redeem myself. 
I like when games are like this. Uh, when even the simple enemies can still kill you if you hose yourself up. Like, you always have to be maximally respecting your enemies. Even if you can beat the hell out of them. Hey, what the hell did you do to those girls? This time, you're hosed up, buddy. Alright. Yeah, dude, if they surround me, those early guys in the game, yeah, they could definitely frick me up. One-on-one, -on -one, they might not be able to do too much. Oh, you blew it, Buster. Oh, you still got the business. Nope! That's two hits. These guys can get taken out in two hits. Sharp blood gemstones and the blood vials. All right. Let's go take our money, buy some more goddamn vials, and then we'll get in there. Easily one welcome back in, dude. All right, what up, buddy? Not home, uh, and I'm intoxicated. Well, it is Friday. You're forgiven. Hey, get the ease the buzz off. Get yourself a Diet Pepsi caffeine free. You'll fall asleep in five seconds. Can't not give you a value. I wouldn't trust my advice right now. Just, uh, hey, I'm drinking Diet Pepsi caffeine free all day, all right? Whatever, I don't even care. Go out there, get naked. Take all the clothes off. It's a great idea. All right. What would I care? Whatever. New, it's a new brand of speed run. Called the nudie run. All right. Well, we're going to go and clean up the rest of uh, Mensis' nightmare. I want to do some looting. Man, we gonna get we got some hot items to pick up. Uh, and then I'm going to beat the hell out of those eyeball guys. Because I'm, you know, I don't like that they took me out. And then we might just go to uh, Kanehurst uh, Manor, Kanehurst Castle. Do that tonight. All right. Let's buy some more damn blood vials. Fill the bank. Whatever you got, fill me up. I don't even care. I don't even care. Hit me. You're naked. Ooh. All right. Well, we'll put the clothes back on. It's probably the right call. Where's my bonnet? Now that is the run I want to play. Excuse me, your time it is. That's the homeless man that asks you uh, the time as you're getting out of your car in the parking lot at the mall. No, I don't. Back away from my car, sir. You're scaring the children. Now we'll go back to the Yargul. Now I truly am a homeless man. Would you put some pants on? Your American Eagle Outfitters uh, shorts just aren't doing it for me. All right, fine. I put on Gascoigne's trousers. I found them in the train track. I would bet that your old man leathered skin has better protection than your church clothes. Yeah, probably. You don't want to dirty up your church clothes, Vale. Okay, we're loaded with uh, all the items we need now, except for sedatives. Should probably buy some sedatives. I don't think you should just be able to buy these over the counter. You can't. Well, God damn it. I'm going to go in here and get hosed up. That frenzy is way too much. If you get fully frenzied, it basically just does your entire health bar of damage to you. God, I can't even buy him here. Not even for all the insight in the world. Well, goddamn. Alright, fine. We just gotta go in and lay waste to this fool before he can frenzy me. Come on, you gotta control yourself, man. Uh, Murgo's Loft Middle. Is Murgo a male's name or a female's name? Is Murgo the mother? What's the baby's name? What the hell's going on here? And what the hell, who's the old man that was in Hunter's Dream? Other questions I have. I tried to look in the Wikipedia today. Who's the old man in the mansion? They're like, spoilers below. I'm like, ah. So I guess I'll never know until I beat the goddamn game. Wait, don't we go back in here? Was it... Uh, in Joe Biden, Hunter's Dream. Joe Biden in the Hunter's Dream. Yes, it was. Oh, Hunter Biden didn't seem like he was doing... His father must... Hunter! Shut it! What the frick is wrong with you? Why do you keep losing your laptop? What the hell are you doing? Hey, sorry, Dad. I left it on the bus. Why are you taking the bus? You're a millionaire. 
You're an energy dealer in Ukraine doing shady deals. Sorry, Dad. Sorry, President Dad. Oh, God, these guys are too strong for their own good. You know what? I ain't taking any guff from this a-hole. Wow. They don't look like much, but those guys can take a hit. They can take a punch in the face. I have so much insight. I might as well just pop all that insight. In fact, I have that umbilical cord. I might as well just pop that right now. Oh, don't. It's gross. I'm doing it. Yeah. Umbilical cords are a lot smaller than you would think. Cartoons and movies make them look like they're big. They're really small. They're quite small. All right, are you guys ready to get out of your minds? I got two sedatives. I should be able to just run across this thing, beat the hell out of this a-hole. We'll do a distance fight. Hold on, I gotta load up. Flip shot, get in here, buddy. Rad only plays when I'm going to bed now. It's unacceptable. Stay a blade. Live like a king. Live like you used to live during the pandemic. Flip shot. All right, the kid, uh, kid's been watered. Back to Bloodborne, all right. Dad, I need some juice. Can I have some juice? Hey, here's your juice, juice, come on, juice. Baby boy Rad likes his Kool-Aid. They throw vitamin C in it now, though. That's something. All right, did you plant them in the dirt first? All right, I don't even know what the hell I just said. I think Murgo is the baby. Well, who the hell's Murgo, then? And why do I still hear the baby crying, uh, even though I uh, killed the bad guy? The dream is I vanquished the nightmare. That's what it said. All right, stick around for this, though, Flipshot. Stick around for the big show. All right, all right, dickhead. All right, sedative, square. Bet you didn't know I had sedatives on me, did you? Oh, you whiffed it. Oh, I whiffed it! Crawl, run! Oh, look away, children. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, what does it matter anyways? This frenzy stuff is completely uh, OP. This frenzy stuff is ruining the game. I don't know what the hell they're doing with this crap. Murgo might be in the depths right now. Can't remember. Freaking Murgo. <sighs> so I found out that high insight means you have lower frenzy resistance. I don't really have that much insight though right now. 26? That's that's a hot tip. That's a hot tip hatter. I think the Tauntress pones these guys. They're weak to lightning. I don't even think I have any gems on my Tonitress right now. I just gotta not get grabbed. If I didn't get grabbed there, we would have taken her to Pound Town. You guys know this. I don't know why I'm associating that with her. Kinda wearing a dress. Kinda looks like Mombi from Return to Oz. Frickin' god dang it. Alright, I need all this health back. You whiffed it, you son of a bee. All right. I don't know, Devin, where do I get sedatives from? I am out of sedatives. Butt ass out. From software's like, hey, you know that, uh, you know how things work in video games? Yeah. Let's do the opposite. The opposite of what you would want. Love of God. Uh, if it's lore, all the people that learn too much about the when it's saying, okay, okay. Yes, Desi. Uh, high insight doesn't make sense because frenzy should make you stronger and faster. <laughs> I'm in frenzy. First, it just does 99% of whatever health you have left. Video game logic. Can't argue with it. Now this is the one where I'm gonna fall off the little uh, metal beam between the two parts. Guaranteed. Okay. Wait, I'm actually out of 
sedatives now. Did that lady steal my sedatives? Ah, for the love of God. Alright, so I gotta kill this son of a bee faster than I can get frenzied. That's no good. This is no good. Okay, uh, anyone know if frenzy takes a set amount of damage off or is it a percentage? Because if it's a percentage, then I think I'll be fine. But if not, then I'm host. Hard and heavy, here we go. Alright, got an itchy ear. I'm not fighting this a-hole with an itchy ear. Medicine that makes still bodies undetectable. Do I have anything that just heals everything? HP invigorates the senses. Restoring a large amount of... Huh? Numbing mist prevents HP restoration. Pebbles, fire powder, boom. Does Frenzy just keep killing you? I think it may. Alright, we're using the bolt paper. What do I care? We gotta do some damage and we gotta do it quick. Pound Town, welcome to it. Sick your attitude, dickhead. Come on, go for it. Fine. Frick. I needed the jumping attack, not that one, you son of a bee. There, stop being a jerk. That's all they had was Quicksilver bullets. Okay, there was no reason for me to be here. All right, well, I fell through the hole in the roof last time. I suppose I gotta go back through the bridge of death where there's non-stop a-holes up there and just be frenzied non-stop because there's so many of them up there. Is there any hot items I can get down here? Yeah. Now this is scary, now that I can actually look what's down there. Good lord. Now that the high's worn off, I was out of my mind to do this. Is that the spider room? It's cleared out of spiders. <laughs> Alright, and I'll go and waste your blood vials. Uh, your body won't be needing them. Uh, fair. I stand corrected. I also feel dumb for not putting more into vitality. Vitality's kind of like... Ah! I feel like vitality's like the... The poor man, if you, you're not pro at the game if you beef up Vitality. That's just what it makes me feel like. Only the real pros uh, dump it into their skill points and things like that. Uh, obviously, I'm not a real pro. I like to say I am. That's where I fell through. Okay. There could still be hot items upstairs, and I will not let a hot item go. How many bath tubs of blood do you think this old man's drunk in this place? <laughs> He's drunk. Drunk on blood. I'm gonna go down smooth. It's smooth as a Diet Pepsi caffeine free. Wait, I have some lines. I was watching Home Alone in preparation for this episode. Merry Christmas. You mind if I sit down? Or may I sit down? That's my granddaughter up there. The little red-headed girl. She's about your age. You know her? You live next door to me, don't you? You can say hello to me when you see when you see me. Don't be afraid. A lot of stuff going around about me, but none of it's true. You been a good boy this year? I swear to it. Yeah, I had a feeling. Well, it's the place to be if you're feeling uh, if you're feeling bad about yourself. Yeah, you can be a little old for a lot of things. Never too old to be afraid. Yeah, how you feeling about your family? It's a complicated thing. Deep down, you'll always love them. But you can forget that you love them. They can hurt you, and you can hurt them. That's not just because you're young. That's all I had. And that is the scene from Home Alone with this character in it. Alright. Alright. I should probably take these stairs down. I never went down here to see what was down here. Oh, another little Frickster. I ate Frickster for breakfast. You eat pieces of frick for breakfast? No! Never too old to be afraid. We are too old for a lot of things. Oh, hey, oh god damn it! Ah, I'm in a bad way, dudes! I'm in a bad way! One second. Uno momento. 
I will begin the no-frick zone in one second. I'm gonna fight for my life right now. God, son of a bee, he's coming after me, dudes. He's got me in the corner. Stop scaring Smithers. All right. Wait, is that the floop zone? No, we don't want the floop. The floop out of here. Flip shot, get the floop out of here. And get the in here. All right. And welcome to being up late, Flipshot. Good to have you. I want to hear from Flipshot. Has he played these games before? I know it's not a racing game that has graphics so realistic it'll make your eyes bleed. No! Didn't have the echo on in that one. I did punch his lights out though. That's worth something. Probably sitting on a pretty uh, penny. What? Uh, don't you know he has a PS4? Or don't know if he has one. All right. <laughs> you were giving me some toot. Don't you know? Oh, lordy. <gasps> no! I'm scaring Smithers. Now you're in trouble. What the hell? I, I shaved some of her whiskers off on that one. All right, feels good. Damn, it feels good to be a gangster. All right, how many of you rascals are around the corner? Just one? You blew your cover! Oh, there was just a hot item down here the whole time I could have picked up. Don't you dare be Madman's Insight. Eh? All right. I've not played Bloodborne, no, but the other Dark Souls games and the Soul S game. All right, so Demon Souls, you're also... You know how the charge attack is the same in DS1 and 2? Charge attack. How do you know... Or how do you do a charge attack? Oh, okay. I don't know if Dark Souls 1 had one, but I think certain weapons have one. You just hold down uh, R2. I think most of the weapons in this game have one, so that's... That's a difference there. Some weapons do, Devin. Like, one of the... You have to... It's like later game weapons, though. Nothing... Nothing at the start of a game will give you that kind of juice. I'm juicing, I'm on the gear. This old man's been on the gear, he's been on at least 10 cycles. Out of my mind. I got shrunken testicles. Size of, size of raisins, but you know what? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter when you're beating the hell out of bad guys. All right, all right. For now, I'll have to sleep and catch up on the VOD later. Oh, I always appreciate that. Well, good to see you either way. Good to see you, Flipshot. Get some sleep, buddy. You've been working hard. Time for an ice cold diet Pepsi. I was doing it. Okay. We're looking good. We're sitting pretty. I don't know where the hell. How the hell do you get wherever the big brain fell down? Hmm. Ultimate Humpy getting here, buddy. This is my fave issue of IGN. If it's your favorite issue, it's mine too, buddy. All right. We've got a little uh, nest egg we're sitting on here. Might as well just pop a bunch of these insights. Or not insights. Uh, it's a whole thing to do to get down there. I don't even know where to begin, though. How do I even begin getting down there? Trying to think where are all the lo locations that I haven't checked. I think I checked them all. No, I can go back up top where all the eyeball guys are. Run past them. On the other side, I don't think I checked everything out. Did I? No, I think Easterly said now you can jump down. But why are things on fire? That's a great question, Desi. Uh, this is the hunter's dream, so as far as I can tell, this isn't real. It's like something that happened in the past, and now you're reliving it or something. If I recall from some of the content I uh, consumed about this game, the final boss is down this pathway and you go through that gate. Somewhere down there? I don't know. I don't know if I can go. Oh! Is that gate open? Yeah, there you go. But I don't want to go there yet because I have a whole host of DLC to go beat the hell out of. This is fine. Hey, you're right. This is fine. I can't believe there's no sedatives at this place. <laughs> 
It really should be. I don't even know where I was collecting sedative. That's a weird thing to collect. They landed three baskets in a row. He's heating up! It's good! He's on fire! Alright, we better fix our cane. When you have a cane this nice, you better keep it fixed up. You know, you don't want to hose this around. I did get a pretty good blood gem as well. Let's see if that can really sit in this slot. Well, that's awful. Why would I want that? Alright, hey buddy. Why don't you go ahead and do 30 less damage per hit. And in exchange, you get blood attacks up. Blood attack. I don't know what a blood attack is. Is that my gun? Why wouldn't this be on the gun then? 26 point or 216 percent. Okay, that is a huge amount of percentage. But I don't even know what a blood I don't even know what a blood attack is. And why doesn't it make my skull this under special attack you get like this one here. That one. Oh, that's poison. Okay, well what the hell is blood attack? The blood attack doesn't even go up. Oh wait, here we go. Yeah, under blood attack, straight down in the middle. Nothing. Alright, firearm damage is blood attack. Then maybe I can put this on. Oh god damn it! Here we go. Blood attack time. Alright, here I am yelling at everyone. And hell with this. Oh god damn that. We might as well uh fortify this damn No, not the No! I would never fortify that. The blunderbuss. Let's go. All the way up. Blood attack? Why don't we go? Right to Pound Town. Whoops, I need five of those. Alright, well, we're not... And that ends our... Ramping up. Nobody makes me bleed my own blood. Nobody! That was a great film. Speaking of Vince Vaughn, we rewatched Mrs. Rad and I Domestic Disturbance last night. No real reason. Alright, blood attack determines the damage of your firearm and weapons that deal blood damage. Alright, so there's only a couple of weapons in the game that actually deal blood damage, so mostly firearms. Which makes a lot of sense to me. Alright, and now can we go up a level? Let's pop some goddamn do. let's do the do. This game did wisely let you just use all your items. If you got a bunch of do, it's like, alright, you got a level 10 here. I'll show you, what, do I have any with multiples? No. Alright, fine. Either way, I'm going up a level. Gammon awaits you at the foot of the gr Go on, good hunter. Okay, so Gehrman was the old man that was in the wheelchair up there. I, so you're like, oh, go talk to Gehrman? Very well. Wouldn't that just make me fight the final boss right now? Never do that. Holy lord, my gun is actually... Oh, never mind. Blood Tinge does jack flute for me. Alright, skill though. Alright. I could become the rolling man. You guys ever hear about that man that rolled across India? Rolled across the whole country. I'm going to become the rolling man across India. A 22 in endurance. Let's go. Fitness level up. You ever been crushed by two tons of irony before? That one, I don't understand. That one went right by me. Good hunter. Not much else to do in uh, India except roll across it, you know? Hey, you got to make a name for yourself somehow, right? He's doing the Lord's work. How dare they sell me pebbles here? What kind of crappy joint is this? There's nothing for me to buy. Fine. Just buy some... Uh, buy some of these. Alright. Uh, big Limp Biscuit fan, I heard. Now I'm doubling down. I have no idea what anyone's saying anymore. But I did get a rune. I might as well check it out. Carl Ruin. I don't remember what it was. Moon, but a better moon. More echoes from slain enemies. Eh. This one's an even better eye. More items from fallen enemies. I like that. What am I currently equipping? Alright, those two, they're staying. I don't have anything here. Why don't I have anything here? What the hell's going on here? And I apparently have nothing equipped in the middle. This whole stinking time. I need to get a better communion, because you can start holding more vials. Alright, well, in the meantime, I might as well just uh, put this one on. 
Why not? See if we can get some fat stacks. Who wouldn't like some more fat stacks? Alright, well, I have no sedatives. Does anyone know where to goddamn farm sedatives? Ah, the rolling man across India. Yeah, he's like, oh man, I just couldn't get enough of this limb biscuit track. Have you heard this? This thing is sick. Rolling, rolling. And he had his little earbuds in the whole time. Say, Rad, have you tried reading the flavor text? Of every item in the game? Is there one in particular you'd like me to read? The ruins, I mean. Oh, no, I certainly haven't been doing that. Carl Runesmith of Bergen and the Twisted Cross means metamorphosis. All right, the discovery of blood made their dream of evolution a reality. Their dream of evolution a reality. So they think they're evolving. They're going to guzzle this blood down and evolve to the next level of human evolution? No. That is only what happens. Hey, we got frick. Oh. It's only what happens when you listen to Tino on repeat for 24 hours. And you'll see. Uh, this does all seem like hot stuff. It looks like a terrible thing to do for your stream, though. Great ones that inhabit the nightmare are sympathetic in spirit. After an often answer will call Tino, buddy! The true specimen. Laurels in your soup enhances its aroma. Oh, we got some Simon's Questers in the house. Alright, where do we go here? We, uh, we'll go up, take the elevator down, roll off, Get the hell to the other side after getting frenzied non-stop. And then there might be some hot items over there. We'll see. And if that doesn't work, then we'll go to Kanehurst Castle. Middle. Rafiq! Oh my god, get in here, buddy. Good to see you. No, Rafiq, I don't have my camera set up. What I'm gonna do next time, though... After I beat this game, Rafiq, what I'm going to be doing is I'm just going to set up a camera on my table, point it down at my phone, and then, and only then, we'll play some FIFA Mobile. You know this, man. Maybe I can play a game against Rafiq after the tutorial mission it makes me do. Hey, look at that. I'm a goddamn specimen. You think I need to know how to do sick uh, bicycle kicks in FIFA Online? Or FIFA Mobile? Hell no. I'm out of my goddamn mind. What, would a normal guy wait for the elevator? Yes? Did a lot of damage, more than it probably should. And I also didn't mean to start over here, so that's not good for me. Oh, lordy Jesus. Alright, well these guys might as well kill me. I'm in the... This is not where I want to be. Alright, good thing I got that extra stamina. These two a-holes don't know what hit him. They sound pretty close and irritable. I've never, no one's ever gone backwards through this area before. Don't mind me, Frick! Sorry! Still in here, whoops! He doesn't have the time to talk to Townsperson. He's busy talking to Rafiq about FIFA Mobile. Always. And what what did you actually specifically want me to type in, Devin? All right, here we go. We're going to do the unthinkable and roll out on the way down. We're ready. I'm ready for it. I'm ready to move on to the next level of human evolution. Whiffed it! Easterly one may or may not still be watching that. Just going like this. Number of times Rad has whiffed is only 108. That's a lifetime's worth. It's pretty good. We gotta go to another damn lantern anyways. For the love of Pete. Wanna go back to the hunter's dream? Yes. I don't know why you choose the long route because I accidentally picked I just assumed this was the oh god back to cold hard reality the, the the walls of reality are crashing down around me you be too old for a lot of things you have too old to be afraid 
I gotta go in the middle. Oh, that's what you were saying. It, see, Devin's just saying, middle! I don't know what you mean. You gotta be more specific. I'm out of my mind. I've been watching Home Alone all day. I'm out of my mind. Middle lantern. I thought you were talking about the... I thought we were still talking about reading the Carl ruins. What does he mean, middle? Ah! It is hard as hell to do this thing. Uh, I might as well get these blood echoes. Oh god, get in the damn elevator. It is super hard to do this on the way down. Super easy to do it on the way up. I'm not gonna try again. I, I've whiffed it at least four times straight. Check out that hunter's nightmare. What the hell is the hunter's nightmare? And up we go. Come on, old man. Get your nimblest boots on, because we got some rolling to do. Rolling, rolling, rolling across India. All right, I didn't even roll. All right, there's one for good measure. Wrong elevator, bro. Lol. I thought this was the one I'm supposed to go on, because uh, this is what I'm trying to do anyways. I want to go across this bridge, because I thought I missed some of the hot items here. All right, he's lolling at me. I take your lol, I catch it, I send it back at you. All right. There's one thing I know in this world, it's elevators. All right, only going up, not down. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Fine, let's go. Town Town, welcome to it. Get the goddamn hell out of here! Oh, for the love of God. That's a lot of games. I don't know if I'm dead or not. Yeah, he's dead. These guys seem a little stronger than the last one. All right, Devin, we boned it up. This frenzy stuff is out. It's, it puts you in a frenzy while you're playing the game. You don't want to die in front of all your buddies on the internet. <sighs> they don't let you buy sedatives. They give you no sedatives in this game. Well, we all know if I would have hit with that second shot, things would have gone down different. Jack it up on the big board. Big board's getting full. Full of a-holes. Oh, I was so close on that one. Ah. I don't want to have to go all the way down. Let's <laughs> see, see, see. She's not seen her grandpappy anymore. Hey, what, why didn't we see grandpa last Christmas? Well, let me tell you a story, Susie. That frickin' a-hole put on his dirtiest robes, ran straight into a castle, and started smacking people with his cane. I don't know, he was saying something about drinking blood. He was, he was drunk at the time. All zero of them. We're going for it again. We're going for it or we're dying trying. Oh god, if you're just a little too high on freaking sedatives. I don't care, I'm doing it this way until I get in the damn thing. You just can't go too early. All right. Way too high. I know what you uh, conventional video game logic dictates that you should be able to push against the wall and not fall out And then as soon as there's a thing there, you'll just go right through, but no, this game is different You will walk right out of that elevator It's got to be right at the moment Or to the other lamp though, which other lamp are you talking about Devin? We'll do one more here and then I'll try Devin's suggestion I don't know that there's a closer one than this one. Oh, is there one where this elevator goes up? Yeah, that probably is Oh, God damn. Smooth as frick. I didn't even know I was there yet. 
Alright, sick of this a-hole. Sick of a-holes in general. Hey, dickhead! Stop scaring Smithers! Alright, do your attack. Frenzy. Heal. Heal. Attack. Frenzy. Heal. Damn it, the frenzy does... Ah, I thought it just did a percentage. You basically just have to be stocked up 100% the whole time. Alright, there's no way I can get across then. Well, hopefully Kanehurst's stupid castle has some goddamn sedatives in it. Because that's where we're going now. Sick of this. There's no way through. Stacks by the look of it, yeah. Bar fills up and then the big, yeah, there's nothing we can do there. They, uh, they run the bridge. The lunatics run the asylum. There's nothing I can do. I tried. I got no sedatives. This game made a whole area that you need to have sedatives for to get by, and I got no sedatives. And I don't know where to get sedatives. You get them on the goddamn dark web, that's where you get the sedatives from. A tactical retreat. Wait, I don't want a tactical retreat and then wait for the uh, frenzy to die down because sometimes it just doesn't die down. Because it, it, even if you run away from them, it keeps building up the frenzy meter. All right, where's Eosako's whatever? I mean, don't fight those frickers. All right, where's the clinic here? All right. Graveyard of the Dark Beast, Church of the Good Chalice. Devin, now you can help me out. Where's the one I want to go to if I want to get 1-1, one, one, so straight the uh, first floor sick room? All right. That looks like a 1-1 one, one to me. Fades back and swish! I'm terrible at basketball. I can't shoot the ball. I look awful while I'm shooting too, so that really takes me out of the game. And if I do try and do it with good form, hip, 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 it just doesn't go anywhere. <laughs> Can't do it. From downtown, boom shakalaka. All right, now apparently there's some a-hole in here. On the other side of the door. Can I go in the door now? Mm, no. What the hell's this? Interesting lighting. Now Devin's on the spot. Well, I don't... If I have to, I'll just look up a tutorial for this. Because this whole area is very confusing to me. I don't, as of yet, know why they... St on all the tutorials, they're like, Well, you gotta go through the poison part in the underground cave to get to this one area up here. Why, whatever do you mean? I thought it was all attached. All right, we'll go check this area out. No, that's the way we came. That was the start of the game. So, that's the clinic. I must go through here. And... I still don't understand. I still have no idea what the hell is going on here. Go outside, then immediately go right in the yard. Somewhere in here. Aha! Uh -huh. Is this a door somewhere? No! Oh, okay, there's another cage over here. And then this, what is this, like the back entrance to the uh, clinic? And how in the holy frick do I pronounce this person's name? Alright, feel like there's some JRPG elements to be found down here. Alright, who's the dead man? Right here! Oh, that's a much stronger enemy than I would have thought. Oh god. Still going. Could 
Could have used some sedatives, but that's fine. This area is dark as hell. Uh, go outside. Eye of Sefka. I, I O Sefka. All right, that's the name. Wait till you see this spelled, everyone. It'll blow your mind. I O Sefka. All right, up here, I guess. I don't know. Hall asked a lot of blues, old man. So what we're doing here, everyone, is we're collecting an item that will let. A, an optional area of the game become available to us, and then we're gonna go beat the hell out of that area. Maybe tonight. Looks like I knew what I was doing there, but I accidentally missed the attack, which would have got me hosed. Purchase from the Bath Messengers is the hunter's dream. After obtaining the Cosmic Watcher badge, periodically given to the hunter by the lonely old deer, she was sent to Odin Temple in the Cathedral War, dropped by slime scholars in the lecture building. Wheelchair Huntsman, all right. Uh, oh, those are sedatives. Okay, thank you, Bill. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. Go to hell, Crow. Look, if you guys aren't going to be blaring Cheryl Crow on full volume, then I don't want to have anything to do with it. There we go. All right, where's the dead man? I'm saying Io Sefka. What about, couldn't it be like Yosefka? Yosefkas. We didn't need this wheelchair. Not buying it. All right. Here we go. Fresh pair of trousers. For our troubles. The Yosefka works. Alright. Hey, Yosefka. Nice. We got a communion level two. That'll probably let me have two blood vials extra. Instead of the zero extra I have right now. I don't think this clinic looks like a, a nice place. Especially after I've been through it terrorizing the place. Be old for a lot of things. Never too old to be afraid. Never too old to terrorize someone in their clinic. Right, my torch is not really doing much for me. It's still dark as hell in here. Said it is. All right. I'm, well, who do we got here? Purchased from the Bath Messengers in Hunter's Dream. After obtaining Cosmic Watcher Eye. Where the hell do I get the Cosmic Watcher Eye? It appears I've interrupted something. Hey, excuse me, do you know what time it is? Can't target her, so she must be Yosefka herself. God, I'm nauseous. Have you found it? It's progressing. I can see things. I knew it. Probably gonna kill her. I'm different. I'm no beast. I'm... Oh, the door at the top that I couldn't go through? God, it feels right. awful. But it proves that I'm chosen. Don't you see how they writhe? Writhe inside my head. It's rather rapturous. The lonely old deer. Did I send her to the Odin Chapel? Maybe I did. Laugh it up! It's hilarious! God, I'm nauseous. What? You're just gonna say all the same stuff? Alright, you're going to Pound Town. She seems nice. Yeah, well, apparently I've read some stuff. I don't know if this is the real her anymore. And I'm willing to take that chance. Pound Town! Alright, what do you got? Another umbilical cord. Sweet. Never too late to chug down one of these. One of these oddly tiny bad boys. I have 30 insight from chugging that umbilical cord. I wouldn't recommend it. Old man lives on the wild side. There's a, yeah, I think it's over here on, I have to go the other direction. 
I JRPG'd it, Devin. So you come in the wall over here, but then you go this way, and I think there's something over here. Alright. Story checks out. Look at how moldy this place is. Alright, what do we got here? One a-hole? One dead man a-hole? You're dead, Becky! Unable to acquire myself because blood vial due to inventory or storage max. Oh, uh, you can only have one at a time, I think. Well, I'm gonna risk it right now. Yeah. Does nothing for me, but I'm gonna do it anyways. Kane her summons. We got a letter. Or as James would say in Silent Hill 2. I got a letter. Alright, now the Kane her summons says... We'll do this one for Devin. Addressed with Dumper's name on it. Oh, that's right. It's Dumper. You're cordially invited. An old bloodstained summons inviting an honored guest to the forsaken castle Canehurst. Rather baffing, bafflingly, it's addressed to me, dear Dumper. Do not hesitate. The stagecoach leaves from Hemwick Crossing. Okay, so they, at least they tell you where to go. Because this whole thing, when you were telling me about it, Devin, it was like, this is such a goddamn, what a goddamn uh, Souls game thing to do. Ah, and it all comes around. Okay. And we're going to warp over here. Man, go to the bathroom. Why? Why in the middle of this playthrough? It's only a two-hour playthrough. I can't hold it for two hours? Apparently not. Son of a bitch. All right, well, while it's loading, I might as well... I'll do it on the next load. What do we got? That type Pepsi cuts right through you. It's got the taste. It cuts right through you. That's a pretty cool missable quest. Yeah, I, I'm glad you let me know about it. I would have easily missed this thing. All right, let's just say I don't want to have to deal with that, so I'll just spend the bank on those. Maybe I'll add a Carl Ruin. No, I don't need to do that. All right, where are we going here? We're going to go to Witch's Abode, come outside, take a trip to Kaner's Castle, beat the hell out of every a-hole there. But first, Rad's going to go to Tinkletown. God damn Oh, God damn it. And give these guys some tunes while I'm doing that. And the tune of choice tonight is going to be... Uh, let's see here. Tune of choice. You guys can get out of your minds to a little... Let's see. Right, why don't you guys teak your balls off? Hell yeah, we're teaking, dudes! Welcome back in, everyone. I'm just tinkling my guts out. What can you do? Hey, when there's there's pretty much no nutritional value in this Diet Pepsi, so your body says, I don't know what to do with this. Get it the hell out of here. Don't stay in here. Get the hell out there. All right. I have been cordially invited, and I'm bringing all of my buddies with me. Party foul? To go to this castle and get out of our minds? I don't know. It's not the pow block. It's the poo block. Why do you have that emote? Bale's got them all. All right, it's go time, and there we go. 
All right. So fancy and elegant. I should wear my nicest threads. Okay, I'm not gonna go to a castle without wearing my nicest outfit. That looks a little better. Well, the bonnet, the bonnet stays. The bonnet's gold. Weird sound effect. Terrifying sound effects. All right, here we go. Now we'll do radio voice. You're watching R R A D D Radio. We're having a great time, and we have a special guest here, the old man from Home Alone. You can be too old for a lot of things. Never too old to be afraid. That's my granddaughter. That little red-headed girl. She's about your age. You know her? Let me get some of these up again. Hey, what the hell do you think you're doing? You got a problem with me? Get out of my mind? I'm an old man. I can do what I want. I do as I please. I'm old. I didn't much appreciate that headbutt. That's nice. That's the place to be if you're never feeling... What did he say? That's the place to be if you're feeling bad about yourself. I'm feeling pretty bad about myself right now. A DJ RRR Rad with the air horn. Meh, 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 meh. All right, you hear the bonnet stays when dumping out. Yeah, we, uh, it helps you out, you know? I don't know if you guys with little munchkins ever have this problem, but baby boy Rad insists on going full commando when he's dumping out. The shirt won't stay up! All right, off it comes. The socks! I can't wear socks either. All right, off they come. Going to pound town. Doing it, doing it, pound. Hey, just got a lucky shot there. Pound town! All right. <laughs> he is George Costanza. You guys see that magic eye poster in there? That is some weird and wild stuff. All right, apparently we have to go look at this thing, and then we can go on a horse and carriage ride to Canehurst Manor. You guys saddle up with me, everybody. I got enough Diet Pepsi Cafe free for all of us. We're going to the castle. We're going to have a great time. He brought 20 viewers with him. What the hell's wrong with him? I wish 20. 10? 10 viewers? Plus, uh, take away at least two bots. Dumper is the Cinderella man. Seems like a lovely carriage. Let's go. And inside we go. Can I hit the horses first? Oh, I'm so curious. God damn it. And now you're never allowed to go to Kaner's Manor. Well, what if, Devin? Because I know Devin's probably going like... What if the dogs were attacking me there? Attacking me there, and the horse got in the way. Yeah, we had to know. You guys want to go to your grave not knowing? That's fine. Not me. Ah, oh, for God's sake. Hopefully, it's not one of those things. If this were demon souls, they'd be like, well, you're never going to Kaner's Castle now. You fricked up, buddy. I think the games have eased off a bit. All right, we know you're being an idiot. Fine, you can go. You have to reload, though. We're not going to make you do that at least. We can only hope. Otherwise, tonight's stream ends nice and early. We're slowly getting there, Devin. Middle! Kind of hear it like uh, Ross in that episode of Friends. One of the only episodes I can remember. Center! Or no, pivot! Pivot! Middle! You didn't go anywhere? You've been... Uh well, no, we don't want to go down here. Pivot. What happens when you're heft up on blood, man? I can't run in a straight line. <laughs> Just a leisurely loop. Ladies, what's up? You want to come with me to Kaner's castle? I could use some escorts. What the hell are you doing to those ladies up there? You do be old, too old for a lot of things. Never too old to beat the hell out of three rascally ladies. It's Bloodborne after all. Bloodborne's a freaked up place. Oh, what did I get there? Are you caught in the loop? Rad, are you okay? What? No, I, I took a swing at the, the carriage and it disappeared. I had to know, Devin. 
I'm gonna take a second go here. Hey, nowhere in the letter did it say, don't you take a swing at this carriage. Oh, it's still there, all right. Pound town, go time. Damn it, I was so early on that one too. No! Oh! Get him a damn body bag. All right, doesn't matter. We got to collect a couple extra blood vials. Ride the carriage. I will ride a carriage. See? That's why you want to wear your best outfit here. You don't want to be wearing the homeless man's threads. Found him at the train tracks. They look nice. You didn't see you strike it. I struck the horses. I don't know what my end game would have been. And by the way, doesn't this just go off a cliff? Are we gonna fly up in the sky like E.T.? Because this just goes off a cliff. That pathway just goes off a cliff. They bleed no, uh, they turned into dust. They just evaporated on me. There was no hit sound effect as such. <sighs> I'll take any blood. I know we're supposed to be having this. Oh, Angel of Death over on YouTube. Nobody travels in a carriage anymore. Get them all a body bag. Welcome in Angel of Death. What a lovely castle. I've been cordially invited. I don't know if you know Angel of Death. And you're all welcome to come with me. I'm sure they didn't intend for that. I don't like how the camera has that. You know what? I'm going to fix it. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Fix this right now. There you go. There we go. I got a trophy. Ooh la la. My horse has died on me. Oh god damn it. They don't even let you see your footprints on the ground. That's whiff number one game. Making sure I'm not missing any hot items down here. Alright, go time. I did the whole cutscene and you didn't go anywhere. You had to go again. I don't know what the hell you're talking about, Vale. Rolling out the red carpet for me and all my buddies. Great, more more people taller than me. Story of my life. I'm surprised we don't get footprints. JRPG elements confirmed! What kind of JRPG is this? Hey, there you go. Confirmed. Frenzy Coldblood. Grungy Nick is now playing Mass Effect Legendary Edition. Oh, Grungy Nick. Oh, we miss him. Can't be operated. Well, goddammit. Don't forget the lamp. Did I miss a lamp? Is there a lamp somewhere visible? Oh, yeah. Jesus. I'm listening to the snow sound effects on the footsteps. Oh, here we go. Baddies. Next time it snows next year, I'll probably take my portable audio recorder out and record some snow stepping sound effects. The world needs more snow-stepping sound effects. All right, let's see if I'm overpowered as Frick or... Oh, God. Hosed. Okay, whoops. All right, these guys pack a frickin' wallet. And they're speedy as hell. Enemy number one is beating me senseless. Now you're hosed, your big blood butt. Oh, God. 2,000. Okay, maybe I... Jesus Louise. Alright, uh... <laughs> How old my Bloodborne trophies are? They're gonna be five years old, I'm telling you. Alright, and Madman Knowledge. Numbing Mist, alright.
Oh, she got sideways attacked. Dead. Yet doesn't drop anything. Whoops, that was a, you know, just, I'm a blood junkie, so that one was just academic. More dead bodies. Going a little heavy on the dead bodies in this game. This guy's teaching you to get good. I need to do some more dodge behind moves. Oh, great. Two at once? That's not going to be good for anyone. Oh, sick. Little uh, alcove down there into a cave. All right. Sure is beautiful in the summer. There's lots of lovely ladies here too, Vale. Blood butt ladies. I'm here, do it now! All right. I'm surprised they don't drop anything. Fresh high fade you got there. Me in real life? Eh? I always go one on the side, please. And they're like, really? Yeah, I don't want it going over my ears. I hate that. I hate when the hair goes over the ears. I don't know if that's what you're talking about, Devin. I hear what I want to hear. All right, we got the blood butt trio over here. You're in the same boat, Vale? When I was a kid, though, I'll tell you guys, the 80s, the 90s hated uh, the 80s. We just hated them. The 80s was for babies. And so when I... There you go. Get over here. In the 90s, uh, I used to see getting a fresh haircut or getting a new pair of shoes as being, like, preppy and dumb looking. I didn't like the way it looked. Now, I would have hated this haircut in the late 90s. Be like, no, man. I've learned to appreciate longer hair over the years. I Well, I did the hair down to here at one point. And so I've lived the life of the metal head. Uh, and then when I got my hair cut, I'm just like, man, I like the way that looks a lot. Well, I know for sure I just like the way the hairs look. But, you know, every time I... Uh, number one, every time. Um... Whenever you watch, like, an episode of Seinfeld or something, and you just look at how big the sides are, it's like, okay, Devin, once the hair gets long enough to completely envelop the ears, then you're living a good life. Just like, it doesn't matter what it looks like now. But when you have short hair, once it starts getting a little too long over the ears, it just looks awful. God, hate this. Get the hell over here. Oh, this is a bad place to hang out. One, two... Three, four, five. Oh, got one in there, you rascal! Gotta be either long or short. It's uh, the waiting for the long that gets annoying. Yeah. Vale, do you ever go long? Did you ever go long as frick? Yeah, all right. Free shot, everybody. Oh, get out of there before you're completely covered in blood. Ah, too late. You've been down to the shoulders, even recently. Oh, goddamn. All right, got numbing mist up the wazoo. JRPG confirmed. All right, no. No foot, oh, there is footprints, isn't there? No, oh, they just leave a little dusty trail. I always grow it out and then cut it short. And the cycle continues. I wished I kept it long for a little longer. I wish I got one haircut when it was long. Grew it for two years, straight out, and then just never trimmed it. I really should have trimmed it once. I was worried I was going to look like a girl instead of a sick metalhead. She's dink engaged. Oh, she she's dinked me. 
Alright, well, there's enough room for all of us to be cheese things. Alright, now what are you hiding over here? There's gotta be some sick items. I haven't had shoulder length hair since right after high school. You've been there, though. You felt it. You lived it. Right, who the hell would invite me to this dump? Alright, we get it. The numbing mist. What does the numbing mist even do for me? Numbing mist does the following. Throw to create a mist cloud that prevents HP restoration. Oh, God. So they're probably telling you... Careful, some of the guys in here will recharge their health. Is there another one of these rascals down here somewhere? Gross. I was invited. You're like chin length right now. What? Chin length? You need to get yourself a one on the sides. Are you doing the 90s uh, undercut? One on the side, buddy. You're a wild man. A true... What kind of goddamn party is this? Alright, well, it's go time. Yeah! Tino, buddy! She had it coming. She had a knife. That's a triple shot of Tina. Do it all you want, Young Street. It only makes me more powerful. And oh. Who's this a-hole? Welcome. Oh, God. She's sneaking up on me. I'm too distracted by Tino's tiny jorts. I hear something big scooting around here, too. Oh, okay. There's a lot of rascals in here. I don't know why I'm scared of all these debutantes and this debutante ball. Not while I got a level 9 cane getting out of my mind. You're tr well and truly dead, Becky. Tino's tiny jorts.com. Cannot confirm or deny that link. Click it at your own peril. And I'm ruining this party. No one's ever going to come back to this castle. Old man came in and started rolling over all our candles. Mm -hmm. ah, got the smoothest. The only thing smoother than a Diet Pepsi caffeine free. Tino in that jacket. Dan, not now! I'm all... There we go. Freaking Dan. Look at all the crybabies at this party. Ah, lighten up, ladies. Let's have a party. Turn on some Andrew WK. It's time to party! Let's party! <laughs> and I have a hit and a great big party! How's it going, Yong Street? What up, my dude? Saw you playing some vampire last night. It's like, should I double rate him? I just rated him the other day. Did he have to knock over every candle in the house? Hello, secret treasure chest. Come on, daddy nudes a new pair of trousers. Reader Palash. Wait, who's the dead man? Someone's sneaking up here. I hear you, bunch of rascals. I think I can't hear you. Just let me put on my Reader Palash. Stop thinking around. Oh, so it looks like I can't even hold it till I have a blood tinge of 10. What am I at right now? Seven? God damn. It. What a terrible house kiss. Dan is beautiful. 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 These are not the lyrics. All the hard enemies are outside. These ladies are a walk in the park. It's a bunch of crybabies. Okay, here, this looks like the ringleader. Go to hell! What? It wasn't the ringleader. Just an a-hole. 
Did we get all the crybabies? I think we did. Oh, we gotta go to the other side. There could be crybabies over there too. Give us the ending lick for every Andrew WK song. <clears throat> And so on and so forth. Oh, Sneaksters are galore over here. Taking a page out of the book of Gary Busey, hey? Not gonna not gonna fly. Not with amateur hour over here. Take that fall damage. Cause old Rad's coming for you. Oops, whiffed it. All right, now the party's getting started. All right, I have to say your character looks like uh, two kinds of trench coat. See, your character looks like two kind of kids in a trench coat. Well, he's only—he's the shortest man in the game. I read Andrew WK's uh, first album. Just a blank black sticker and his bloodied face. That first album, what a banger. He's had, actually had some really good bangers in the last few years as well. All right, I love New Dan City. I love New Dan City. Oh, yeah. I don't know how the rest of it. Here we go! Sneaksters galore! Oh god! These ladies kind of remind me. Do you guys remember at the beginning of Ghostbusters 1? Oh my god. That's nightmare fuel. The ghost that's just reading the books. Crying women games just make me think of Left 4 Dead. I never played enough Left 4 Dead. Was there a lot of crying women in the game? Did he have to kill all of the ladies' party? Yes, he did. It was at Walmart. Oh, noble dress. All right, well, we, you know, when in Rome, everybody. Uh, it really accentuates my form. No need to cry anymore, ladies. I'm the angel of death. The time of purification is at hand. It'd be too old for a lot of things. Never too old to wear a lady's dress at a party. That's my granddaughter up there. A uh, little redhead. What the hell did he say? Happy Saturday, Shorty. Get in here, buddy. You're just in time for my live reading of Home Alone. The old man from Home Alone. Merry Christmas. May I sit down? That's my granddaughter up there. A little redhead girl. Hey, she's about your age. You know her? Hey, you live next to me, don't you? You can say hello to me when you see me. You don't have to be afraid. There's a lot of stuff going on around with me. Uh, none of it's true. You been a good boy this year? You swear to it? I had a feeling. Well, it's the place to be if you're feeling bad about yourself. You can be a little old for a lot of things. You're never too old to be afraid. Yeah, how you feel about your family is a complicated thing. You have deep down, you know you always love them. You can forget that you love them. You can hurt them and they can hurt you. And it's not just because you're young. All right, there we go. I'm the prettiest debutante at this ball. Naked ladies everywhere. God. What am I looking at? One dead man. That's who I'm looking at. Did not know who was fricking with. Uh, just time for Grumpy Gamers in hand. That's what Shorty Straw will be known as now. Oh, I bet you there's hot items down there. This beautiful young lady's about to go take a look. Actually, it doesn't look like anything's down there. Out of hell with it. Bloodborne Home Alone trivia. Ah, you're doing the Lord's work there, Young Street.
Get a load of the dead man. Oh, he got me, goddammit. Let this fine young lady go. Alright, those guys can do a bit of damage. But they also can't handle their cheese dinking. No one cheese dinks harder than this old man in a lady's dress, alright? Looking sick, Alfred. The dress really makes you a uh, cataract and your eyes pop. And all the blood on your, on your buxom lady figure. Gotta love that cheap one shot after the grab. Yeah, it seems like that's the name of the. Oh god! Not anymore, Buster. Up, oh, God no! Frick! God damn it! Okay, that's not good. He screamed in my face. Downtown. Welcome to it, buddy. When you get there, tell them the old man sent you. The old man in the purple dress. They'll know. Surrounded by 12 foot tall naked ladies. That's the way I want to go. Dead man. You think you can fight with a cane? Oh god, you can! That's not a cane, that's a rapier. <laughs> this old lady, she fine. Dodge City, oh god. Welcome to Dodge Town. Population me. I'm raking in the bucks over here. Look at this, goddamn. Alright. <sighs> I knock these down. Uh, missed opportunity. I really don't have to walk all the way back in here. There better be a lantern soon. Hot items. Confirmed. Wait for the ambush, everyone. There's definitely an ambush waiting for me somewhere around here. Sneaksters! Double sneaksters. Holy god. That has some range. Oh, here we go. Oh god. I'm too old to get cheese dinked by an old man in a lady's dress. Get out of my goddamn body bag. Oh, he's still going. Uh, not just an ambush. It's a whole goddamn tree. Am tree. This place I had to farm for blood chunks, I think. Alright, this place gives you blood chunks. Well, so far I've been getting jack fluke from these enemies. Now you're dead, Becky. Alright, any blood chunks in here? Any? Got any more brain busters? Ah. Do I get anything? <laughs> what does this outfit do for me? Worn by the nobles of the old bloodline that traces back to the forsaken Kanehurst castle. Wait, what does it say? Whoopsies! Oh, get that back on, buddy. You're gonna die of freezing cold and a broken heart. A finely tailored Bordeaux dress for the buxom lass. Wait, what stats does it have? Well, it's better than the doll's dress. I'm getting some protection from this. It must be very thick. Hey, quit your crying, ladies! Party's starting now. Ah, it's not a party till an old man dives headfirst into a, a wooden chair. An oak wooden chair. There's an elevator shortcut around the corner. Don't die! File blood register. In here, you say? Oh, my dress! Don't 
don't look at my dress, my fanny. Front and back fanny on full display. How the hell did I get over here? Did I honestly walk all the way around? Through that, over that. All right. Yeah. Well, we got the shortcut unlocked, everybody. Now we can die fancy free. Actually, I might as well just go back and spend my blood vial. Not my blood vials, my blood echoes. A shortcut for next time. Eh? Eh? Maybe I'll beef up my blood tinge. It's the tinge. Lock it up. What do we got? It's uh, 11.48. We'll go for like 20 more minutes. Rad's got to write some tunes tonight. I'm this close to finisher. I'll go when I'm good and ready. And you didn't say anything about my dress. I'd need to get to 10 to just be able to test out that thing. Never actually beat the boss from this world. Is it hard, Devin, or is it just I didn't care? I just didn't care. I didn't care enough. Blood tinge makes my blood damage go up, doesn't it? Um... Not that I need blood damage. Not like I'm like, <laughs> just blowing dudes away with my, uh, blunderbuss. Now what do I care? I'm jack of all trades. It's not like I'm going to do any PvP or something. I need to throw these at some ladies. I mean, there's so many items in this game, like weapons and stuff, I didn't even test out it. The, the gameplay would be completely different with a different, uh, weapon. What's the, what's the deal here? Hunter Blunderbuss. This thing does way more damage. Repeating pistol. Way more damage. It's just not as durable. That's the big trade-off here. You want a more durable weapon? I should have been using this thing the whole time. Well, live and learn. Uh, let me go put on that other Carl Ruin. Get myself some more, uh, what is this? Oath memory. Do I have no oath memories yet? What a ripoff. Uh, communion level two. Oh man, check that out. I can get 23 of these buggers in here. Hell yeah. Well, Devin, have you ever beaten the boss in this level wearing a lady's dress? I don't think so. Unless you were playing a lady character. Or just a rascally goofball. I just spin them all. What do I care? That pistol is a lot better, isn't it? Yes, it is. Devin, yes, it is. Uh, where the hell am I going again? Actually, I don't even know which one it's in. Old man, get... What the hell are you doing? I bet you it's up here. Because it doesn't actually exist. Nope. It does exist. Alright. Go over here, maybe? Graveyard of the Dark Bean. <laughs> I don't even know what the hell I'm supposed to... Where... It? Moonside Lake. Is that where it was? Maybe? Shouldn't it say Kanehurst Castle? It should be with the witches. Alright, witches abode. Hemward Charnel Lane. Do you think we're talking Moonside Lake? It's lovely this time of year. What's that, Devin? Sounds like it's not a good messenger. To take the uh, horse and carriage there again or something? Guys, we're waiting on Devin with the ominous O oh, Frick. Oh, Moonside Lake's where I fought the spider, that's right. I guess we might have to take the goddamn uh, horse and carriage back there. Or not, according to Devin. Devin, spit it out, buddy. Hey, spinning anyway. Yeah, this old man from Home Alone is wearing his finest debutante dress and his best bonnet. I'm competing with her. Look, I can't compete with her. And McLean Veiled. Yeah, we might as well just go here and back in the carriage. 
And what Charnel Lane? Uh, I don't think Charnel Lane's the one. Probably just witches about. Welcome in, Yaden, buddy. How you doing? How you doing? What's the current game on your roster? What are you playing these days? I'm gonna guess. I'm gonna guess. You are playing Zombies Ate My Neighbors. That's worth a shot. Metroid Prime Remaster coming up. Okay, sick. Is that a full remaster? Like they do the whole thing from scratch? Or is it just like, well, now it's now it's widescreen. Ladies, this is how you wear a dress. Actually, I have zombies on the list. All right. Hey, hey, don't you go hit those ladies. Oh, he did the spinorama. I can't prepare for the spinorama. All right. I've actually never played Zombie Ate My Neighbors. I think I've, I've seen it in passing, but I don't think I've ever sat down and played it. All right. Easy money. I don't need no more tempering blood gemstone. You give me the straight goods. And how dare you hit a fine young lady like this. All right, back we go. Oh, dear, Devin. Do I... All right. Where the hell is it? It went down this road. Forsaken Canehurst Castle. All right, well, let's see if we can find that one then. I mean, I did like the lantern, right? I came back there. No, I didn't go back there. All right, the dogs are giving me the business. Go to hell. Ow. You mean my dress doesn't give me uh, amazing defense? Maybe the horse is under the weather. You know, after you killed it and all. Maybe it is like Demon Souls. All right, we got to go back to Kaner's Castle. By any means necessary. I don't actually even remember what's down here, so now I'm curious. Oh, yeah, it was just a room with a guy in it. All right, well, that uh, settles that. Maybe Vale was right. All right, you're thinking it's called Forsaken Kaner's Castle. All right. I mean, I can't wait to play that uh, Metroid Prime when we get there on the show. I think it's coming out this year, 2002, on the big board. All right, nothing doing there. Forbidden, forbidden, Hemlock Charnel Lane. Forsaken Caner's Castle. There we go. It was the Forsaken. Why you gotta call it just call it? It's Forsaken. Just so you know, it's Forsaken, buddy. Do you want to know what he really is? Who can finish that sentence? I know when he is gonna get it. Forensalul. Vale did not get it. I, now I look exactly like the old lady that has Tweety Bird. That Tweety Bird, ah, oh, heavens to Megatroid. <laughs> Boom. Nothing to get, even spelled it wrong. <laughs> Alright, right, Vale, you're off the hook. Hey lady, welcome to Pound Town. Boom! Oh, she took the whole hitter right in the face. Right, this seems strange. All right, psych everyone. I actually know why the stairs are here. I'm pretty sure I would have figured it out on my own. Whoa, 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 what the hell's going on here? All right, no one told me the ladies would be doing all kinds of fricked up stuff. Putting weird ruins on my head. The runes. Ah! 
party sucks. All right, time for some cheese dinking. Cheese dinking, goddamn. Just kill her, goddamn. I got the Evelyn. All right, God damn it, lady, you're scaring us. I'm gonna change my name to Evelyn. That's what we have now. Fall damage, hell yeah. Pound town. Eh, hey, quit your complaining. Look at the latest victim of a good cheese dinking. Ah. All right, feeling pretty good about this. Wait, here we go. Here's a good move. One of these, and then an L1 immediately after. Ooh, I like it. Although she, is she blocking it. All right, super soldier number one over there. Hey, can I equip the Evelyn? Apparently, oh no, that one makes, that takes an 18 in blood tinge. I ain't got it. We've been neglecting the blood tinge. Looks like she's gonna get the cheese dink you with her ferociously bad breath. Yeah, she's been eating nothing but cheese. Pretty good graphics. Dead man come through. Lord, this guy came to play. Oh, it's another one of those stabby guys. All right, he's throwing crap at me. That is rude. All right, Quasimodo's got some knives. Playing with knives. All right. Oh, I do see a little rascal. No, it's just another Quasimodo. Where is the a-hole throwing them goddamn knives now? Dead man coming through. Oh, Jesus. Bob, ah, bro's got the range. Hammering R1 so fast at all points in this game. All right, somehow we missed an item over there. And I ain't gonna stand for it. Got it, locked it up. How did I miss this? All right, always with the crying. You should call it Crybaby Castle. All right, three unanswered hits. Dumper, you must be getting... I don't know, maybe it is hard to fight while you're wearing a debutante's dress. Oh, here's the a-hole. They're too little, I keep missing them. All right. One bloodstone chunk. Find any crybabies. Ah, there's a crybaby. Your sword, actual sword, is no match for my cane. It's not the dress, it's the corset under it. It'd be hard to move in this thing. That's fair. Alright, there's a window open over here. Let's dive out. Live like kings. Oh, hello, secret item. 
Quicksilver bullets. Come on, give me a little more than that. Oh, it's just those two guys. All right, who's the crybabies? I can hear you. Am I sneaking up on this old man in a lady's dress? Thing I dumped that one extra stat in uh, stamina. Wind blood shards. I haven't seen those in a while. Man, I'm strong as frick. JRPG confirmed. Damn it. No. Wow, the crybabies are coming hot and heavy in this room. I'm kill crazy. Oh, this is probably not good. Alright, stop scaring Smithers. Jeez, dang. Uh oh. You can't out cheese dink the cheese dink master, alright? Put some lipstick on those crying ladies, Billy Madison style. How's the song go? God damn it. Boy, am I glad I called that guy. Steve Buscemi, what a handsome man. That guy's throwing stuff at me. I'm trying to find a new pair of trousers. That's right. Thank you, Yaden. That would have driven me nuts. Man, Adam Sandler always knocks it out of the park with the uh, selections for his... Oh, God. Son of a... Movies always have pretty well chosen uh, tracks on the soundtrack. Killer, goddammit! I... I don't know how effective that attack is, lady. Notice how she's holding her head, though? Anyone ever seen Return to Oz? Mombi? Mombi was scary as hell. Gaden, come on, you've seen Return to Oz, right? The last time I mentioned that on my stream, no one had seen it. What? Fine, keep giving me sick items. I'm wearing a lady's dress to complete this castle, and there's nothing you can do about it. Mommy and the wheeler scared the frick out of me. Yeah, the wheelers, too. And also the, uh, what is it, the Forbidden Desert or whatever? Oh, yeah, if you touch the sand, you'll just turn to sand yourself. Remember that shot where the one wheeler fell in the sand? Turns to sand, and then his head breaks apart, the sand version of himself? What? Oh, God. Alright, I think I'm at an impasse here. Where the hell am I supposed to go? With Feruza Balk and Sand. Lol, yep. Alright, Vale knows what's up. Yeah, it was the last time I... Uh, I don't think Devin had seen it, and I don't think Yong Street had seen it. Someone hadn't seen it. That movie is scary as all hell. Dorothy! Gnome King was pretty unsettling. I love that movie. I don't remember the Gnome King. What was his deal? Gnome King. I also, you get them mixed up. It's Never Ending Story and Labyrinth and Return to Oz. They're just all right there. All right, well, we're going this way now, apparently. Oh, at the claymation, yeah, at the end. Oh, God. Choose the right one, too, or else you get turned to a gemstone forever. God, the, the stakes were so high. Never been higher. What the hell's the point in coming in here? It's just the same room. No, it's a different room. I take it back. I take it all back, everybody. Go time. The actress who played Mombi was awesome. She was Bav Morda in Willow as well. Oh, I didn't know that. That is hot. Jean Marsh. All right, I didn't know that. Dogen, welcome in. Late night, Dogen. Dogen's never here this late. Oh, actually, this isn't that late. I just found out Super Street Fighter 2 on the X68K 
has an amazing FM soundtrack. I would honestly say it's better than the CPS2 original. The MIDI is great too. Well, you know what? I don't actually think Street Fighter's MIDI or the like the samples they used are awful. It's a truly awful soundtrack, but the the compositions are fantastic. That I will stand by. So if you could load it up with some awesome FM, I bet it does sound six straight. JRPG confirmed. Yeah, that is a perfect chance for a JRPG. All right. That lever's a little too steampunk. Sorry, as the Yanks would say, that lever. Would you pull the lever, please? That sounds like something an English bloke would say. We gotta pull the lever. Yeah, there's the. It's an Entenmann. They have a display at the end of the lever. I think I've already been up here. So what the hell was the point? Some funny's going on. Yeah, like the more I listen to the Super Nintendo version of the soundtrack, it just sounds awful. And the CPS2 versions also, yeah, they're just not too firm. Drop a ladder? Did I miss a ladder somewhere down there? I hop this banister? Hell yeah. Alright, obviously it's a sick shortcut. Looking for ladders here. Upon the request of my good buddy Devin. Oh, uh, <laughs> what? Why would they even open that up? I guess because it's just a shortcut. Weird way to say lever in North America, but leverage. So leverage and the lever. I guess, but when it's something like that that's purely mechanical, it doesn't seem like it has leverage. So then, uh, and I bet you, I bet you though the weird thing, I bet you English blokes say leverage. There's a ladder. Well, come on, there's no way anyone else saw that ladder. I'm like, Brad, you're blowing it. That ladder was completely invisible to the untrained eye. Alright, more sick trousers coming our way, dudes. Leverage. The warm blood gemstone. Hell yeah. What does that do? I ain't got warm blood. I'm cold blood as a frick. Alright, what does it do? Blood tinge scaling 13.5. I don't got no damn blood tinge. Yep. No. Yep. No. Yep. No. Yep. Yep. Oh. Ah. It's gonna be the one I don't look at. You guys will just wait and see. Dead man coming through. Oh, this is not a dead man. Come on, give me the good stuff, buddy. Blood chunks, all right. <laughs> Get him a body bag. What's, what's, what's the light here? Why is there light just here of all places? Let's just run sideways. Oh, the camera auto changes. All right. Uh, English people are not to be trusted uh, in pronunciation. Have you ever heard them say lieutenant? Lieutenant. That's true. Where'd they get the F? Hey, thanks for stopping in, uh, Yaden. Haven't seen you on stream during my hours lately. That's a bummer. It's not gonna fly. I gotta change that. Uh, Canadians say lieutenant too. <sighs> what? What Canadians say lieutenant? Show them to me, Vale. I'll give them the hard ring. It's lieutenant data, not lieutenant data. All right, here's the JRPG conundrum. Down or through the door? Down or through the door? Military Canadians. They have got another thing coming. Oh, that's the way I came up. All right, here we go. <laughs> I'll do better. It's, it's clearly all your fault, Yaden. Can you break these icicles? Ah, whiff. God damn. First, normies don't, because we uh, haven't been brainwashed by the mil military industrial complex and all that industrial music they listen to. Feels like a boss fight's up here. Devin, confirm or deny? Boss fight? You want to quit while you're ahead? 29 doesn't mean nothing to me. I'm rolling deep all the time. I'll take this boss down to pound down. Are we talking boss fight up here, Devin? Because if we are, we're going betting and then we're calling it a night. One and done. Because time is up.
and I will not be removing the dress. <laughs> this old man is filthy. Get a load of that deep V. Get your laptops out now. You're confirming? Boss up here? All right, we're going to bet, everyone. If you guys want to win some rad bucks, take your bet on whether or not rad will take this boss to pound town. First try. I don't even know who the boss is. Don't care. Doesn't matter. Whoa! Jesus, old man. He's rooting, tooting out of his mind. Rad beats the boss. First try. Yes or no? I'll give you all two minutes to make up your goddamn mind. Castlecania. What boss? Dogen, I don't even know. There's apparently a boss up here, and if there isn't, I will refund all the rad bucks. If that is an option. Bingo! Get to bed and get your laptops yet. Get your goddamn laptops yet. What a horrible goddamn night to have a curse. The morning sun is vanquished, the terrible night. All right, while you guys do that, I'm going to fix this camera. There we go. Oh, my God. The pressure's on, dudes. First try. First timer. There we go. This beautiful young lady is about to just take this boss to pound town. I'm too old to be afraid. I'm too old for a lot of things. Never too old to put on a purple dress, run on top of this castle, fight a monster. Never too old to start wearing debutante dresses, covered in blood. All right. Where's Desi with his 600k? Oh, that would be a risky one. Oh man, because it. I'm surprised to see first time boss this high up. You guys are rolling the dice. I love it. I'm going hard and heavy. Let's see what we got. I don't want to bone this one up, so are we gonna... We got enough to do some arcane damage here, that's good. What do we got in terms of uh, fire paper? It's hot as frick out here, I might as well use the fire paper. This he has so many points. I might as well just beast pellet and then fire paper up. What we're gonna do is put the beast, or the fire paper over here. Yeah, fire paper. <laughs> All right. So I tied an onion to my belt, which was the style at the time. All right. We also gotta uh, get to living in the city. All right. As if I'm gonna take a boss to Pound Town without living in the city, blaring in my headphones. All part of the bet, everybody. Yeah, better armor, says Vale. Do you guys want me to beat the boss in this, or do you want me to get a tiny bit of uh, armor defense? Fine. If I sang like Andrew WK, which was the style? Beat the boss in the Home Alone armor. I do have better armor. I got, I've got. i collected sick armor in this castle. You guys have rad bucks going on it. I might as well take it seriously. The bonnet stays. The bonnet stays. The bonnet is gold. All right, I don't know what's coming up here. I don't know what we're going to have to deal with. Is it going to be some arcane frickster? Is it going to be some gargoyle ghoul or something? I don't know. This is reminding me of the bell tower uh, gargoyles from uh, Dark Souls. So I'm thinking there's going to be a guy. There's going to be some kind of winged creature up here. That's what I'm betting. So let's go physical defense. Or 110 is the number to beat. 110, Hunter Garb is still the best defense in the game. What in the world is going on around here? Oh, this one's good against Blunt and Thrust. Okay, Knight's Garb. Really good against Blood. And it has some resistance down there. We might as well just go goddamn Hunter's Garb. But no pants on this old man. What in the frickin' hell? All right, we'll put the knight's gloves on for no real reason. Sixties, the number to beat. I don't know what what the hell is the point here. You might as well just wear the starting outfit all the time, no matter what. 
don't fall to your death, mate. Okay, it's apparently tough. Beat the boss, looking fabulous as frick. Shorty, there's people that have some money going on tonight. You might have money on it too, but I don't want to make everyone upset. <laughs> Alright, apparently I can fall off here. I don't want to do that. I do want to be living in the city, though. That's a fact. Where the hell is living in the city? I swear it just changes itself in the middle of the night. Why is it up seven spots? And then it's going to go to Teak London. And then we'll go Racing Force name entry. No, 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 no. That is horse crap. Let's get one more rad jam down here. Uh, no, 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 no. Shinobi Whirlwind, yeah. That's the one I'm going to beat her to. I assume it's a she, I don't know. Shorty's risking 10k on this match. Alright, here we go. What? No, not the Tom Trust. Let's go this. Shorty. Boom. Well, this doesn't look like a boss. This just looks like an a-hole. Well, there's no boss as of yet. I'm currently out of my mind with damage, though. Alright, what is this? Knight's wig. Still gotta find the boss. Well, Devin, I thought the boss was right up here. Devin, what the hell? Across the bridge, maybe? Up there, fight him up there. gonna let me down except for where the hell is the boss in this level Devin I gotta get off I thought the boss was right here oh my god over there perhaps all right well Well, hopefully the boss is in this room. Otherwise, we have to call it quits. Rad's got to get to work. All right, it feels like there could be a boss right up here. Am I right? I'm petite though, Vale. There we go. Odd items. Are they trying to tell me something? You better get turned back, buddy. Boss coming up here. Boss battle come through. All right, it feels like we're good. Hold on, there could be hot items over here. We don't know. Here to make it right. In that city! Alright, this feels like it could be it. Alright, get your laptops yet. Here we go! Nothing ominous about that path. Uh, it is like the bell, belfry gargoyles or whatever. It's like a. Oh, maybe not. It's a crusty old timer. He's even older than me. That Kane Hurst himself. Boss intro is wasting the music. I'm sorry. I thought it was going to start hard and heavy. There's no time. Alright, go time, dude. Oh, God. Frick. 
Okay, well, apparently I do a frick ton of damage to him. That's good. Right, he's too close to the wall. I can't do my sick maneuvers. Oh, that is creepy looking. What the goddamn hell? Why does it go through a wall? I feel like an area of effect attack is happening here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Did anyone notice? Was he charging his health up there? Cheese dink maneuvers engaged. Oh, God, he's cheesing me. Stars are shining bright. Not right now, goddammit. No, oh, get the hell out of here, old man. What the hell kind of moves are these? Oh God, what is going on in here? Get off the wall, you son of a bee! Oh, it's a guy over here I can target. All right, you're dead. You're dead, Becky. Ah, he got me! No, he got me! Rick, heal! Ah! I can target the stupid sword, everyone. Anyone else see that the sword could be targeted? It wasn't until it kept looking way down at the other end of the hallway, or the, the, the rooftop or whatever. Something's going on over there. Rad let us down again. All right, that guy will be the start of next episode. Poundtown. Taking him right to it. All right, well, that settles that now, doesn't it, everyone? Shorty, I'm sorry about that. Goddamn. Prediction time, and the prediction is as follows. No, he doesn't. I mean, some of you rascals stole a bunch of rad bucks from members of this stream, and I won't stand for it. 7k, woo! <laughs> Veil just keeps coming up on top. Ah, freaking sword. That's why I just kept getting damage done to me out of nowhere on that fight. Ah, man. Oh, God. Did you, did you earn some bucks there, Devin? Or at least Devin got some bucks. We day trade in rad bucks. It's about the rush. The thrill of just getting out of your mind. All right. It's a good night tonight. We did good. We got a boss just sitting pretty for next episode, but next episode won't be tomorrow because tomorrow is Saturday night, and you guys know what the hell that means. If you've subbed up to this channel, if you goddamn put the money on the counter, said betting it all, real money, you guys have earned a seat in the producer's table in the Discord. Get your buns over there on that Discord. On Saturday night, we watch a movie. We review a movie, because that way it makes sense, legally. We're going to review a movie on the Discord. There's a private channel on the Discord just for you if you link up both of your uh, Twitch and your Discord. I don't condone it, but you know what? We all did it. It feels sketchy as frick, but we did it.
Uh, turn 9 hundo into 6k. Now that's a good night's betting. A thrill of potentially having to sell the house and living under the bridge. Now that is a thrill. You know what's a bigger thrill, Shorty? Just leaving a loaded gun pointed right at your penis at all times. Oh man, at any moment, any moment, it'll be the end. Also, another thrill is just listening to Valdezir teeking out of our minds. Like the audio equivalent of just stimming out of your mind. All right, that's the episode. We had a great time. Hey! If you guys ever see Dan at this club, you let me know. He's not welcome here. He's not welcome at this club, and you know what'll happen if he shows his face around here. Alright? Alright. Alright, so I guess, you know what, we'll probably just watch Demolition Man tomorrow night. Demolition Man on VHS, from an actual VCR. I'm out of my mind. Come and get out of your minds with old Rad. Now let's get the hell out of here. Uh, let's find someone to raid. Gotta raid someone. I'm taking suggestions, but I'll also, uh, open up the vault. And see if there's any rascals from the Radland crew just going out of their mind. Twitch.tv. Why don't we get some endings jams here? Teak is out of his mind, but he's not a good ending jam. Alright. Yong Street's not even going tonight. What the hell is this? Have you ever seen Being There? I've never even heard of it. Is it a new move? Alright, let's see. Hit the grams going, doing some music. Org Volca sample 2 unboxing. That's kind of fresh. Haven't seen Hit the Gram in a long time. Maybe I'll investigate. From 1979. I know, right, Yong Street? How am I supposed to bring the rascals over there if you're not even streaming tonight? The vampire's not gonna beat itself. Oh yeah, I better watch this McDonald's commercial before I can watch them stream. Twitch, you gotta fix this. No one wants this. This is a chaotic mess. A lovely chaotic mess, but I don't know what the hell I'm looking at here. Let me just see if music is actually playing. Looks like... Can I hear just the slightest bit of this still? Hypnogram is currently dinking around with a bunch of weird gear. I bet it's this delay still going. Why not? I haven't seen Hypnogram in a while. Let's go see Hypnogram. Uh... I'll stretch my back for just a second. Oh, don't stretch your back now. We're about to come and party our balls off. Ah, to hell with it. Ah, whatever. Let's raid our old friend, Hypnogram. This is like back from the uh, console Cold War days. Hypnogram's old school. Turn that down and off. Sky Witch is live playing Breath of the Wild. <laughs> oh, well. If... How y'all doing? What's going on? Hey, you know he's... Okay. So far, I super like this thing. All right, we'll go. Now nah, we're gonna. Only we're gonna complaint do. is that my hands are quite large, and that makes it a little hard to get. Balls in partied right up. Stuff, but not as bad of a problem as I might have thought. He also says no back seating and no spoilers. Sure. So, God damn it! Don't do that. I don't know if he goes uh, by he anymore. Some things, if I'm trying to get do whatever, for follow his lead. Stuff, get a little finger gymnasticky. Just follow the finger gymnastics, all right? But that's just because I like to I like to fiddle with things live and in the mix rather than like write stuff out ahead of time. I like to fiddle with things. I like to noodle around things. And old hunter, oh god damn it, over on YouTube, we just ended. Man, we just ended, and we're over on Twitch right now, and we're about to just go raid someone else. So uh, the sh the show on YouTube's about to end. But keep your eyes on the channel because I'm going through this game first time, buddy. And old hunter, I could use your advice, but I don't need spoilers. Because uh, all these rascals over here on Twitch actually bet bet uh, currency. Not, Real currency on whether or not I'm gonna beat bosses. I just got to the boss on top. Took me to Pound Town. God damn. God damn. Click the button. Follow around, buddy. We're gonna be playing this game almost every night, except not tomorrow. But Sunday we're going hard and heavy. Like a five hour five hour show. Alright. Well, whatever. It's time to get the hell out of here. Alright, I'll send the Rady Rascals over there now. Get how to use it. Red bucks is real oh, currency. Cool You're right. I can't argue with that. All right, let's get out of here, everybody. I feel like there's gonna be a lot of really fun, cool stuff to do with this. Hey, old hunter, I'm still here. I like it a lot. I'm still over here, but all the all the Twitchers oh, left. That's how you know this is a special right stream just for you, buddy, and anyone else watching on YouTube. 
You will get it eventually. Just Attention. keep it. Oh my God, I was keep at it and you'll succeed. Yeah, I was actually close. I didn't realize the dang sword was doing damage to me. The one he puts in the ground. Oh. God. FMV. And I was playing like this college kid. And it would, this it would is get you the, the other streamer we went and saw. Left and right. That one had me laughing my balls off. That was a genuinely good FMV game. I don't I'm gonna go normal because I'm a regular. What the hell is going on here? Uh, as much as you want to be Hanzo, he's not sure not what this clip good. is. Nothing you gotta be Power Maru. How's it going? How's it Why going? We'll just keep it so those <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. All That's right. The thing is, like, sometimes they just don't make any sense. All right. Thanks for watching, old hunter. We'll be back. Uh, oh, we'll be back. Kind of jamming with this. Don't you worry. Uh, with All right, we gotta get the hell out of here. Sandwich. And hi, by the way, like hit the follow or hit the subscribe button on YouTube. Follow me, buddy. I need your help in this goddamn game. Stuff on it yet? It's always nice to watch some old, a, uh, old veterans watch me device. play through the first time. First time. And uh, I like it a lot. All right, we gotta get the hell out of here. I know. Like. It's very large. Fred, party us off, buddy. Swizzle me timbers. Yeah. This is this is usually my like talking to.